And I think actually framing it like that is really important because I don't think the Labour Party has come to terms with why Tony Blair won and why Labour's lost every election since. And I don't think they want to go there. And what the Labour Party cannot accept is that it has been wrong on some of the big issues facing the country and that its behaviour and its policies have actually repelled people. Labour truly believes itself to be morally superior to the Tory party. And in that judgment are the seeds of its undoing, mm. because that's not how people out there think. It's not how the public think. The mm. British public are broadly pragmatic and they will make rational choices based on the, on, on, the, on the options that parties choose to give them. And there's a reason why Boris Johnson is so popular and the reason why he won that landslide. There are a number of things. But if you put to, to the public, Jeremy Corbyn is a candidate for prime minister, you shouldn't be surprised that it takes a long time to repair that relationship. Uh, history, I mean, the present has damned it. That was an outrage to have him as a candidate for prime minister. It was the worst moment in Labour's entire history. Mm. That's not, you're not going to undo that in a year and a half.